put it up. As okay, as first as round, what are you buying? You're buying a frenzy? Oh, yes, Lord, sure. frenzy. I mean, I guess it's not the worst. Nothing, eh? They're in a uh, one of five, one of five race. Be careful of a lurk mid, actually. Four spawn. I probably would have dropped. Honestly, I probably would have dropped there. When you have a frenzy, you have to only you have to isolate close range fights, right? Also, maybe you should be playing like B. Day day, day. running out A, satchel that A. One rafter going heaven. We have the bomb in A, guys. Spikes here. We have an A, have an wrap. Reloading. Okay, peaks are good. Okay, exposed from two angles, but honestly, your peaks are not bad. Oh, yeah. You have ult for retake. Nice. Nice. Could be out. Still in sight. Nice, good shot. Nice pick. Oh, he's dead. That's full from the I would save your ult here for retake. What's happening? Careful. Help me. Oh, okay. Yeah, we have, we have, we have. Ult? You want to flash the right elbow, side. Two elbow, one main. Uh, Yeah, so your ult covered all of left. You need to do something about the guy on the right. You know what I'm saying? Get out of my way. What would you rate raise on split? Really good. Raptor. Nice flash nice, before nice, he peeking. Nice, nice. All right, there you go. Raptor, nice, nice, nice. Stay alive, stay alive. I think I would wait a little bit after you. You want to wait the rain of flash out before doing this. Every time I peek something, I always wait out the rain of flash. Save. Viper. That was a good play though. Off the stars here. Yeah, this is a good rotation. You guys don't have bomb down. You can't commit to the site. And the thing is, they could have already formed the timing on you. One enemy remaining. It looks like the last one's mid. Stunning for him. You're holding the roast for him. Alright, get stuff. Get stuff. He's gonna judge somewhere, maybe. Take him. They have a wall, like two off result, and kill, uh, one off kill joint. Dude, honestly, you know what I would play? Okay, so this is a good stun. Don't get me wrong. This breach is this breach stun is good, but I feel like you could get more value out of breach. I low key think you can get way more value out of breach here from maybe just playing mid here and popping popping flashes like through the wall here. Or playing back sight. Dude, playing back sight behind the map, it's so strong. You just you have two attempts of getting like free kills and if there's if they go hell with your flashes. It's so strong. You want to fight this I think is it's so it's like gimmicky, right? They have to be like on the right path for this to actually work, otherwise you get cucked here. No way, man. Sorry. One enemy remaining. New box box. Wait, wait, wait. Still alive. You got careful there. Uh. 105. Nice job. Let's flush them out. Reloading. You're super healthy. That's good. Yeah, for the most part, yeah. Careful there. You should run. Nothing. I eat pretty healthy stuff. Forever. Okay, let's go. 
80 on Astro Hell. Okay, 3v3 retake. I actually think you could have stopped this ult, but it's all good. Spike planted. On elbow, elbow, you saw him elbow. They're planted B, guys. This guy's close CT. There's no way he's not close CT. I bet money on careful. it. Yeah, I bet money he's here. Never mind. I don't. I don't bet money. One guy. Inside it, maybe. My brother said that. <laughs> Planet for main. Last player standing. One enemy remaining. Give me the money. Listen, listen, listen. Lag. I was some lag right there. Okay. So first thing. Put yourself in situations, situations where you can optimize Breach's abilities, specifically his flashes. Make sure you're not exposing yourself from multiple angles. There's a couple times where I, I'm noticing the way that you're peeking something, you're putting yourself in a spot where you're you're open from other angles. You want to avoid that kind of stuff. Yeah, okay, you have a stun. What is this? I think a stun for heaven is better. I think a stun here for heaven is better than it is for this. This is like immediately stops the rope guy, but that rope guy shouldn't even be a problem. It's for your team to push into heaven. So I think it's utility usage. I think utility usage is a big thing. I already used the word optimize. It's going to drive me nuts. Utility usage could be more efficient. So like here, I would have liked you to save your stun for heaven and then wait for your whole team run up mid and then once they're close then you stun up heaven and then your whole team kind of runs it you know what I mean? you know what i mean that's what i would have done <laughs> who's getting coached okay you guys one I like the. Okay, this is a good. That's a good stun. It's a very good stun. Be careful here for the flank. Oh, you could have gotten hella timings on the A ramp guy. Nobody was watching A ramp, dude. Oh, I threw, I threw, I threw. He has his gun. Oh, that's not looking good. Screens. Okay, so let's go back here. Look what happened here. So this stun, this stun comes through. This, I know that they Roomba'd up, but this Roomba could have been timing on the left side here. This guy could have timing the Roomba, came down to the wall, and then pushed the wall here and gotten you as a free kill and maybe Viper. So there's something to think about, right? And if you are the last person with a sight and your team has sight just like this, then there's no sense in you pushing in with them, right? You don't want to all cluster into the same spot unless you guys are all playing on sight. Uh, and you're not giving out any guns, but I would like you to watch flank here. If you're the last person out and you guys have sight, the second sight is cleared, boom, immediately run back, watch flank, as in watch the ramp push. So that's what I would have done. I think you guys gave up way too much control here, and this this round was very easily losable because of it. What's up, Rico? You have a good timing. Screen oh. stopping. Careful there. One enemy remains. So, okay, one thing I'm noticing, you're kind of giving up a lot of control. You're you're giving up a lot of space and control when pushing into sites. The sites for free. Like your team kind of already has all of this cleared. Only thing you need to be watching now is holding the heaven here. And you get caught in these timings. So let's come to my city. There's Jolly V. Hey, alright. So I'll come by, I'll get food, and then you can paint my nails, alright? We'll do that. Yeah, okay. One thing I'm noticing, you're getting caught in these timings a lot of the time. You see how you're just kind of jiggling back? You're not really watching anything, and you get caught in these timings. 
really you should really uh commit to one thing that's being watched so for reference both of your teammates are heaven and one of them is watching your main you don't need to peek main whatsoever so this is this is your immediate threat and i wouldn't even recommend this angle i would maybe like hug here and then watch it this way or like something different but i i think you're getting caught getting caught hesitating with positioning i think that's like the main thing yeah, what happens here Okay, I guess you didn't know he was opping. I think the peak was fine. You were just kind of clearing stuff. Yeah, I think the main issue here is hesitation with positioning. And positioning. Positioning is the main thing on attack and defense. Mid. Oh. Careful could have been CT. Out of charges. Nice job. Get out of my way. That was good. I like that. That was better. You have ult, you have ult. My Viper, help him, G. One enemy remaining. Wrapping? Yeah. Holy shit, dude. Viper kind of almost griefed that round. Holy. That was almost scary. Okay, so you have ult here. You... Are you gonna rip this? You want to fight it? Yeah, one's flanking us spawn. No, you need ult, man. You got to find a way to ult somewhere here. Ah. Uh. You're so fucked. I have two bullets. Dude, you have two bullets. Ult. That's a good flash. This is where you should be playing on defense, I think. Yeah. Okay. Okay, anyway. I think the main issue was positioning. I think that was the main problem that was happening here. Indecisiveness with what the angles you were holding. Uh, exposing yourself for multiple angles when you're peeking one. Some of your abilities could be better utilized. And positioning on, on playing on breach. You can use your utilities a bit better on defensive side. Um, giving a lot of space and control on attack side instead of watching the flank. And making sure that you maintain uh, control of a choke point. Like main or something when you're pushing into the site. Like if you're the last person out and you guys have sight, you need to go back and watch what you were watching, you know what I mean? We don't be your channel is definitely You watch your peak and you'll never be relevant. Now we got beef and now I'm here to settle it. Channel ain't growing, you might wanna pedal it. You are like seven who used to develop it. I'm way above you in another element. Keeping the trunk like a motherfucking elephant. How you work out, I say still not intelligent.